Hey guys, and welcome back to Dark Souls 2. I am Cat, and yeah, I know we're not right where we left off last time, but I just want to get over a few things. You know, life's moved on. So, I am now in my new place. This is no longer pre-recorded, well, it's pre-recorded because it's YouTube, but this is no, no longer recorded like 18 years ago under a, you know, computer that is a thousand years old. Well, actually it is, my computer hasn't changed. But, new place. That's really what we're getting at here. Uh, and, which means I am a little, gonna be a little rusty, but I don't think it's gonna be too bad. Unless I die here. Alright, also what we did is, uh, or what I did, whatever, uh, is I have gone and killed uh, Birdman again with the help of some random guy. And that means I am now at complete full health to fight uh, Shortel Man. Now, Shortel Man, you may remember from last episode, which was not as long ago for you, but it was quite some time ago for me. It's a bit of a dick. We don't like Shortel Man. But we will kill him because we have full health. That's the plan. That's my plan. That's the plan I'm going to stick to. Uh, now, there is also one last firewoman over here, which I've got to probably deal with. But thankfully, my shield and having full health will make that easy. So, Short Hell Man. Now, the thing, problem with Short Hell oh, we could also go that way. No, Short Hell Man is the problem. The problem with Short Hell Man is our shield is pretty much useless, but he do, and he does heal. But I reckon if we get the first the drop on him, there he goes, he hates that. Jeez, super aggressive to start off with. Oh, jeez, he hurts, he hurts. Okay, he's probably gonna go heal. But I'll also heal. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Get away from Shot Hell Man. Oh, I definitely do not want to be that way either. Because that is where there are those mushrooms. Not today, Shot Hell Man. Oh, I wonder if I just poisoned him. <gasps> I just poisoned the Shot Hell guy. Well, if that's the case, maybe he's going to die to poison? That would be good. I think we just killed him to poison. Well, that was a little bit cheap. But you know what? I accept absolute cheapness in Dark Souls. He made the mistake of, like, walking into the poison room. I claim no responsibility for that. No, I claim every responsibility for that death. I killed him. Um, but why are we up here? That's the real question. What was so important that we had to come up here for? Um, there's some poisony barrels. Oh, we're just on top of those guys now. Ah, it would be nice if I could push those barrels down. Bonfire ahead, okay. No, I don't think we can push them down. Although, maybe we can... This is a long shot here, but maybe... We can hit those barrels, and they'll, the jars, and they'll... That was not working at all. Oh well, that's fine. It'd be nice if I could push them down. But clearly that is not a thing. So why did I kill the short hell guy? Uh, no reason really, I guess. Hmm. Okay, no, I do not want to fight those guys on top of that. That seems like a bad idea. So we're going to use the old trusty bow. <gasps> Wait, no. No, no, no they're, they're angry. They're angry about something. They saw someone, and they're like, oh! Okay, this guy is pissed off. I've angered the uh, first guard, the guardian of the gate. Oh, okay. So I kill this guy and then I fall down so I don't need to walk through the poison. That's a clever way to do it. I'm like a genius if I'd worked that out ahead of time. I didn't, but oh, where'd he go? Uh, am I being poisoned right now? Why, why was I being poisoned? I did nothing wrong. I didn't deserve that. Uh, alright, just random poison. Sure. Is it even worth using a life gem? You know, let's use a life gem. I don't know why I got poisoned. I didn't do anything wrong. I blame the president of Uganda. I don't even know who he is, but, you know, that's more reason to blame him. You know what I mean? I mean, do you know who the president of Uganda is? I, it turns out I'm actually talking to, like, international diplomats, and someone's like, Yes, I talk to him on a daily basis. Wow, see, why are you a jerk? The president of Uganda did nothing to you. Um, really, I don't know what I'm saying. Okay, Foggate, these are always good. Is it a boss? It's probably a boss. 
Oh, shite, it is a boss. Uh, and it's in a poison place. Oh, brilliant. Oh, it's like a Medusa, except she lost her head. Okay, it's murdered Medusa. Uh, okay, well that was... That was a really uh, poor show on how to fight that, because all I did was sort of stumble around and get scared. Okay, so stumbling around and getting scared, not the right way to fight a Medusa that's lost its head. This sounds like it should be obvious. I think school children learnt this, but... You know, I didn't learn my schooling from people that believed in Medusa. You know, I mean... I believe... I went to a school of people who believed in Tanifa. And if you don't know what a Tanifa is, oh, oh, let me tell you what a Tanifa is. It's not real, first off, so don't worry too much, kids. Um, it is a water monster. Really briefly. Um, it is a thing that lives in rivers... And it, you know, I don't know what it does aside from lives and rivers. It, it's the local indigenous monster, and they had turned up in Magic: The Gathering at one point. I think in Mirage, it was useless. It was a bad card. It had like Island Home of all things, and you know how good Island Home was. Am I right? The joke is Island Home is a terrible, terrible mechanic. Um. For those wondering why I'm not playing Magic at the moment, it's because I'm trying to save up money, like a great deal of money, uh, and playing Magic is a, called a bad way to save money, unless like you've got a ton of cards, in which case you can actually make money with Magic, but I am not a mag magical entrepreneur, as they are called in some circles, and if they are actually called that in some circles, I call bullshit on that. No one calls them magic entrepreneurs. Entrepreneur. It always sounds like a word that you're just stuffing up when saying it, doesn't it? Entrepreneur. But it is actually a word. Kids, look it up. Ask your economics teacher. He will say entrepreneur like that. Because that's how our economics teacher always said it. Oh, shit, I forgot that fire mage was still there. Alright, there's still a fire mage up there. How do I get unpoisoned? Oh! Hello! Crap! Why did that happen this time? This is really bad! And I'm panicking a little. Okay. Uh, that was definitely not what we wanted to happen. I'm still poisoned. Oddly enough. There's gotta be a way to wash myself off. Running around in circles does not help, and I'm gonna be poisoned. There we go. Poisoned! Yes! Best mechanic of the game. Okay, now roll away. Oh crap, I'm gonna die. You know, if I put up my shield, I might have just... No, I wouldn't have. You anyway, know, I'm gonna see you once I kill those two guys, because that was really just me messing around for no reason. And I'll see you in a minute. Or, oh, for you a second. Alright, so we've killed those uh, two guards, and they've both given... Oh jeez, what a great fall for no reason. Okay, so let's go fight the Headless Medusa. This time we're not going to be afraid because we are going to be valiant dang heroes about this shit. Okay. The fact that she doesn't have a hit is rather startling though. Oh jeez. Well, I managed to hit her that time at least. Well, that was completely unremarkable. Uh, I've been told to explore the Helga's Tower of Flame or whatever it's called I've forgotten again uh, it's not called Helga's Tower of Flame I know that much but I've been told to explore there and I haven't done that yet and I think that might be next episode depending on how this Medusa goes because this rate if this Medusa keeps being like this I uh, might stop doing it we'll see see you there hello okay um sorry for that uh, so, you may have noticed that my armor has changed, because I was thinking to myself as I was climbing up here, what is the dangerous thing about this Medusa? Why? It's the fact that she kills you. Yes, thank you for that. It was really fucking helpful. No! Well, yes, but no. What's really dangerous is the fact that there's poison. So I had a look at my armor, and it turns out I actually have some armor that might help against poison. This mannequin mask, it does reduce my stats a little bit from my falcon helm, but it gives me a lot more poison resist. And the stats reduction is not much. Grave Warden Top 
I was wearing this. Turns out, this is much better in every regard. Plus, it's got double the poison resist. Uh, these cuffs, I was wearing, like, something. I don't know what I was wearing. It's probably this. Uh, this is better, actually. That is actually better as well, and it's still lighter. Brilliant. And these leggings, well, I might just leave the leggings as they are, unless we can... No, because I'm already wearing the highest level leggings. Okay, so, we've changed our armor. Let's do this. I feel good. I don't feel good. I feel good enough. Let's just do this. Let's not complain. Talk about how good I feel. Okay. Ugh! She hates that. What I hate is the fact that I'm dying to poison. I really can't fight this fight long. And given the fact how little I've hurt her... Ah oh crap, I'm gonna die to poison in a second. Unless I heal. I did not heal on time. Oh! Okay, I was already dead, but... Okay, I've got a few ideas how to beat that. It's really just the poison mitigation I've got to get sorted though, isn't it? Uh, is there places that have sold me poison? Ah, oh, poison resist. Do I have poison resist? I do. Okay, see you up there. Got a plan. Alright, are we ready for this? We've got a common fruit and we're going to eat it. Nom 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 nom, common fruit is delicious. Okay. Let's do this! Leroy! No, never Leroy Jenkins this. You know that. Okay. Okay, then she leaves. Okay, now I'm gonna life gem. Oh, okay, that's the scream. Wait, is she healing? She's bloody healing. Which means... Is there a way to turn the poison off? Uh, okay, she heals. She heals while I die. Okay. Mm Maybe there's a way to turn the poison off. I'll see you up there again. It's interesting, uh, the people are starting to not come back, which works fine for me. I hate them coming back. See you there. Okay, we're back to where we were, and more and more of the uh, guard of uh, Medusa's guards are leaving. Medusa is a really unoriginal name, but I don't have anything. The, ga the game's actually come with something more, more original than me for a change. Um, okay, so I'm going to run around the outside and see if I can... Maybe I'm just going to attack her from behind, or... No, I'm just going to die to her again, I think. I think that's the plan. Yeah. You know what? I said I was going to do this next episode, but I'm kind of... The problem is I've got too many ways I can go right now, so when I get stuck against a wall, I'm like, you know what? I don't want to fight this wall right now, and I just leave. Um, I've been thinking about Bad Horse lately, and I do want to go back to Bad Horse, but... Right now, I think it's time for Heidi's Tower of Flame, because I was told I did not explore this enough. Um, and I'm... Well, I thought I'd explored everything, but clearly not. So, uh... I guess I'll explore Hides... Hides or Heidi? It's probably Hide, not Heidi. What was I thinking? Anyway, Tower of Flame. Let's explore this place. For glory and justice and all those other great things we like to say when we're just looking around for cats. I mean, I don't know about you, but I always say glory and justice when I'm looking for a cat. Um, oh, wait. I didn't explore this place fully, did I? There was these guys. These guys are kind of not too bad. I say I'm about to be... Oh, I didn't get hit. Okay, they die in three hits. So their huge size kind of makes them look a lot scarier than they actually are, I suppose. Yeah. I'm fine with that. Oh! You know what we should do? Before we uh, venture onwards. Hopefully he can't get through that door. He cannot. Good. Um, before we venture onwards, I think we should just put on our good gear. 
Um, because there's no reason having a bunch of sweet armor when you're not wearing it. Okay. We're gonna keep that uh, chest though, because or the top, because the top's pretty good. Oh, this guy's got a shield. Okay, he's dead now, probably. Oh no, he's got one more hit on him. Weak, weak, two hits. Oh, big spender. I don't know why he's a big spender, but you know what? That's what he is. Um, if I've been this way before and this is all retreating old ground, I'm sorry. Like, I really am. But it has been two and a half weeks since I played this game, so. And I, I tried watching my old videos, but I got distracted because I started looking at Cookie Clicker. <laughs> Doesn't that just inspire my viewers with confidence that even I love this series when I'm just like, no guys, I want to play Cookie Clicker. Because that's clearly the right thing to do with my time, instead of prepare for videos for entertainment purposes. I like it. It looked like he stubbed his toe when he died. He's like, oh, these adventurers are causing me to stub my toe again. Um... I feel like I have been down here. Well, that's quite far down. Be wary of jumping. Yeah, you know I can't disagree with that. That's definitely something you should probably be wary of. What are these chains connected to? Oh, the ceiling. Probably more chains. Okay, well, let's go down. And while we're going down, let us uh, praise the sun. I mean, that's some real sun praising there. I kind of hope that at some point I get Solaire's armor from the first Dark Souls game. Uh, that's that's like one of my biggest hopes in this game, that I get to see Solaire's armor again. I mean, I'd like to see Solaire again, but, you know, I think he's dead. Or maybe he didn't die. Maybe you had a better experience than I did. <laughs> Rhea? I can't take this. I can take it from the rear. Don't you worry about me. Illusionary wall ahead. Yeah, whenever people say that, it's like... Maybe if I rate it, then I can... No, that's how you drink potions. See, if people are marking an illusionary wall like that, then how am I supposed to press A if there's a... I don't understand illusionary walls in this game, I really don't. I feel like I'm too stupid for illusionary walls. Alright. That's like my teachers always said. They said, see, you're too stupid for illusionary walls. You believe in every wall you see. I was like, sorry, teacher son. I don't know why I called them son. Or use the Japanese honorific since I did not use those back then. Why do I use them now? Because I am weeaboo as hell. Sometimes. Sometimes I'm as weird as hell. Um, I feel like this is just where I was, but I, at the same time, I probably... No, I've clearly been here. There's a chest here. Um, okay, well, I have been all this way. There's a door, though. Think carefully and then detour. Okay, well, I'm gonna... Uh... Not go through that door, I suppose, since it doesn't open. Okay, that's clearly not how you explore Hyde's Tower of Flame. Because that is a dead end. Alright, I'm going to explore a little bit, and I'll let you know when I find something that's not a dead end. Well, a big hole in the wall, that's usually a good clue that's not a dead end. I've always appreciated a big hole in the wall. What killed you? Or maybe I've already been through this. I feel like I've been through a big hole in the wall. Uh, hang on a second. This is the dock again, isn't it? It bloody is. That's... That's the unseen path to hide. That does not help me. That's the way I came in. I've, I've done all this. I'm sorry, guys. 
Uh, I'm having fun at least. Exploring these places I forgot existed. Um, I guess I'll... I guess I should backtrack then. If I should backtrack, I should probably go back. No. Let's backtrack, because sometimes you see things on the way back that you didn't see the first time. Like, uh, this. This was all here last time. Yeah, because it's like that path that I had uh, in... Earthen Caverns or whatever the hell that place I just left. Where it's like, I walked past one place like so many times, and then when I walked back I was like, Oh look, there's a path there that I never once saw. So maybe it's going to be like that. Maybe I'll just see a path that I missed because I'm silly that way. Uh, so far, no secret paths. So there's this guy who's like saying illusionary wall, which... No. There's no illusionary wall. Illusionary walls are not real in this game. My teachers were right. Oh, that's right. You exist. But I don't care for you. Rolls. And I run. And then this guy exists. And he just sees me scamper away from him. He's like, what? Hey, how'd you get behind me? Wait. Oh, did you come from the unseen path to hide? And I'm like, yes. He's like, oh, I hate it when adventurers do that. Ooh. Uh, I may have just trapped myself. This may be very bad. Oh. <laughs> oh no, that is the worst. Alright. <laughs> okay, I'm going to teleport back to that place and hide that I was at, and then I'm going to explore from there. Thankfully those uh, stone guys... Oh god, I, I don't like spawning into there. It reminds me of the bad times. Okay, let's go to the Tower of Hide. Like that guy from that 70s show, you know, the one that was cool. He was called Hyde, but it's spelled differently, so it's probably Heidi. Hyde was cool. He was like Fonzie, except I don't know Happy Days, so maybe he was nothing like Fonzie. Maybe I should just shut up about references I don't get. It's probably the best idea. <laughs> Look, I know, Fonzie was a character in Greece and everyone loved him. Yes, and I know he wasn't from Greece. Okay, so... That was where a boss was, the the red knight. Well, these guys fall down pretty quickly now, so I think I just r kill them and run past them. Like last time I was up here, I was sort of in a bit of a hurry because there were bad guys everywhere and they were trying to kill me and things were bad. But now I've also got a lot of arrows, so I can also just shoot arrows at people. But because he's got his shield up, I can't hurt him. Even though I'm hitting him in the foot. That's how logic works, guys. The slow plodding sound they make is kind of fun. Plod, 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 plod. I really want to take out the, that guy first. Ow! You know, maybe I'll go over here and it's this last. That might be a good idea. Ow. No, 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 roll, 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 you magnificent bastard. That's me, by the way, in case you're wondering. I'm the magnificent bastard, I've now decided. Uh, I don't think you're allowed to give yourself that title. Okay, that's that guy down. Old knight armor. Yeah, that armor's not going to fit me, though. Alright. Good luck. Alright, so. There should be one more guy in here, I think. I don't know why he didn't come with them. He probably just felt left out. He's like, oh guys, don't worry. Oh god, the cathedral. You you guys go and have fun without me. Man, I used to think these guys wouldn't like respawn when they died. Boy, was I innocent back then. Well, because they look big. They look like they shouldn't respawn. But they're actually really easy to beat. I say as I took a hit from that guy. But I mean, comparatively to how I am now, they're, they're easy to beat. 
Uh, okay, well, there's two. What we I don't rightly know. You know, I don't actually want to fight these guys. Actually, I want to fight one of them. I can fight one of them at a time. I have a sword man. I just put my shield away and... Oh! He's coming for me now. Ooh, nice hit. Okay, put your shield away, you kill them really quickly. Good to know. I wonder if that's a thing I should be thinking about the Medusa. Maybe. Might not be a bad idea. Um, okay, so I'm up here now, and... I don't rightly know why I'm up here. I mean, there was a, a thing over here to pick up before. But maybe some stairs downwards? I'm missing something in Hyde's tower. But then again, this is a vantage point, so maybe I'll have a clue from looking around up here. Okay. Uh, let's see. You got a message? Praise the sun. Okay, good message. Oh! A thing opened. No, no, that's important. Maybe... Oh, what's happening? Oh! No! Okay. I thought the drawbridge was going to land on me. <laughs> that would be a very Dark Souls thing to happen. A drawbridge. Just... The Cathedral of Blue! That is not a blue cathedral. Or maybe it's just sad, like... Oh, I'm a blue cathedral and I'm having a bad day! Oh, Dragon Slayer! Ah, oh, crud bunnies! I do not want to fight a boss right now, okay? Oh! He fights like Ornstein! Oh, shit! Because Ornstein was a Dragon Slayer! Oh, shit! He is just Ornstein! What the hell?! Okay, we're fighting against Pikachu. But Pikachu on his own wasn't too bad. He's gonna do his lightning rush now if I know this guy. Okay, as long as he doesn't have hammer butt. Ah, uh, it's now that I've realized that I don't have any Estus Flasks left. That's probably a bad thing to have realized right about now. Ow, sir, if you could please leave my butt alone. Yes, lose vision of him. That's probably going to save your life. Oh, good dodge, sir, good dodge. Alright, don't worry. Even though you're bigger than me, I am more awesome than you can possibly imagine! See? You see that rolling? You only hit me once. Okay, he's far away. He's probably going to lunge at me now. Or not. He didn't lunge at me, but... I'm using all my life gems. That's bad. Okay, yeah, let's just go ham on him. That's a good idea. No, I'm going to die here. Oh, Pikachu. This is why I never choose you. Actually, let's go ham. For no reason. Because going ham at that moment seemed like a really good idea. Oh! The dodge was too slow! Okay. That guy is completely beatable, but unfortunately, guys, we are out of time. In fact, we are well over. So I will see you next episode, and we are going to kill that guy, because he is so beatable! Yeah, beatable! You're a beatable, that's true. You're an asshole there. I hate your dog. I wish you weren't a poo. You are totally a poo. Alright, see you guys. That was ridiculous.